if a person like me, I don't know if it speaks to you as well, these systems can be automated. Whereas they have a call and physically do the manual labor, you can have systems in place doing work for you. You can have sensors monitoring the nutrient solution, delivering to your plant what it needs, when it needs it, without you being here. You can have apps on your phone where you can monitor these things remotely. So you can be on a beach, I mean, in, you know, Bele or in a beach, but I have done this already, right? I am a practicing hydroponics as well as aquaponics and aquaculture farmer. My systems don't need me to be here 24 hours a day, right? Once my systems are set up, it probably takes me about 10, 15 minutes a day to monitor an entire commercial production facility. And I don't need to be there every day, right? And this is one of the major advantages. If you're thinking about getting into agriculture, yeah, you want to do farming, it's fun, it's whatever, but we also have to take up for the same as our business. The world too is looking for what's more sustainable ways of growing food, right? People will pay you more money for growing crops with less pesticides and quote unquote organic, right? So we have all these benefits of hydroponics, we have all these benefits of aquaculture. Aquaponics combines the two to give you a mess of both worlds. And aquaculture, which is a fish like what we have out in tanks, if you cover that and share the nutrient solution, well, then, like, it will build up over time, like, it fills the waste. And you'll be converted into the system. Um, there are four 